Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So a question I get asked a lot is, do I plan my paintings in advance? Do I know what I'm going to be doing before the paintbrush hits the canvas? So here's my answer. Sometimes I plan ahead, sometimes I don't. I knew that this ugly, ugly painting needed some help. Once I did the base coat, I actually set it aside for a good couple days. That thing, it, it was bothering me in the corner because I could not come up with an idea of what I wanted to do. So what do you do when you hit a creative block? What I've learned to do is to set it aside and work on something else. Work on another painting. So that's what I did. I ended up working on several other paintings that I had. When I went back to look at it, I saw these two houses. When you don't have an idea of what you want to do with something, it can be very, very frustrating. So if you ever find yourself in that situation, just set the project aside. It doesn't even have to be art. If something is frustrating you, set it aside, take a breather, take a step back, and do something else. Go for a walk. But when you come back to it, come back to it with fresh eyes. I don't know if you did this when you were a kid. I would look at the clouds and try and come up with some creative ideas of what I was seeing. So, you know, you might see a sheep or you might see an elephant. Your imagination is very powerful and it's important to cultivate it. You know, we've been told, get your head out of the clouds. But for an artist, imagination is everything. When you create from imagination, your creativity flows. And whether or not it's positive or negative depends on the things that you think about. If you see yourself as a very successful artist, you see yourself learning and growing and you're happy about that, and you see it in your mind, your art will show it. And it'll also help other people. There is so much negativity in this world. We need art that will lift people up, bring hope back into the world. So be that person, be that artist. There are good things that are coming out of you. And the more that you think about that, the more that you believe that, your imagination will actually start giving you ideas for really good paintings. Let me know in the comments if you create a new art piece or project or if this video was helpful for you. If you enjoyed the video and you want to see more, feel free to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time.